Hi there folks and welcome to my channel. My name is Tyler and today we're going to the Walt Disney World Resort. If that's something that interests you, hit that like button and let's go. We've just landed here in the Orlando airport on our way to the Mears Connect. Mears did replace Disney's Magical Express. Looks like we still have some old signs up though. I think we're just going to the same spot. So I was right. We are going to the exact same spot Magical Express used to be in, if you ever took that. Which makes a lot of sense because it is the same company, but this version you do have to pay for. Now the buses are also the exact same without the Disney theming. Uh, so the wraps on the outside are gone. And the video that they're now showing is more inclusive of all the other parks I've seen. Universal, Disney, Icon Park, uh, just in the couple minutes that we've been sitting here waiting to go. It was about $30 round trip to take the Mirrors Connect. I just checked Uber and Lyft. The pricing for one way is going to be over $30 in itself. There are two of us on this trip. If you're a larger family, Uber, Lyft, or renting a car might be better for you. Studios, and we're looking for something to eat. What do you want? I don't know, it sounds good to you. I don't know. And ABC Commissary it is. With the buffalo chicken grilled cheese and the chicken club. Anthony, what did you think of your chicken sandwich? It was delicious, really. Good. I'm glad. This time, for the one thing that neither of us have done in this park yet, and that is Galaxy's Edge. Personally, not a huge Star Wars fan myself, but this one over here, he is a fan. Even though I'm not personally a huge fan of Star Wars myself, I am very excited for Rise of the Resistance. We'll be doing that a little bit later. The theming in this area is honestly like nothing I have ever seen in a Disney park. Disney always does such a good job with theming, so I shouldn't be surprised, but this doesn't feel like a theme park. This feels like I'm really walking around in the world of Star Wars. They have this bowl of wisdom tokens, and I pulled one out at random, and it says, if you only knew the power of the dark side. So, I think I'm a bad guy. I have not been here since Galaxy's Edge opened. But this time of year, end of January, has been the time that I have come for many years. I'm not sure if it is always this busy since this new land opened, or in the 50th, or what, but this is so far more crowds than I have seen in any of my years going. We actually just missed a character experience with Kylo Ren and a couple of the stormtroopers, but they do meet here under this ship, and right next to it is the entrance to where the Galactic Star Cruiser is going to be, which should be opening in just a couple of weeks. And we're going to come back to Star Wars a little bit later in the evening, but for now... Let's check out what Toy Story has to offer today. So a change of plans and instead we got Joffrey's. I got, it's called the Golden Age. It is passion fruit. I think that was the only flavor, just passion fruit. And they're very good. Very sweet, but very good. We changed our plans again. It's Mickey Mini Time. Another thing that neither of us has done since it opened.
while I did love the great movie ride, it was definitely time for something new, and this ride does not disappoint. It's so beautifully animated, incredibly immersive. There's this really cool moment where one of the showrooms completely changes behind you while you're distracted by one of the screens. Let's go! It was really awesome, and who wouldn't want to ride through the world of Mickey Mouse? We forgot our chargers, so we have to go back to the hotel for a little bit. But don't make our mistake. Okay, so that took significantly longer than it should have. Uh, basically, we got back to the hotel, and you can use your phone now to get into your room. For some reason, that was not working with my phone. Uh, whenever I tried it, it would pull up my Apple wallet instead. So we had to go down to the front desk and get a physical card. But we got that, and now we're back at Studios for the rest of our day. Back in Galaxy's Edge to ride Smuggler's Run and hopefully get on Rise of the Resistance. Two. Thank you. Oh, hello, my friends. I am Kondo Omaka, and this is Omaka Transport Solutions. Today, I am offering the opportunity of a lifetime. All right, Anthony, what did you think? That was pretty crazy. Yeah, I liked it. I didn't do well, but I had fun doing it. BB-8, at the ready room for recruits. BB-8, is everyone assembled? Good. The Resistance desperately needs your help in our fight against Kylo Ren and the First Order. Starting to transport. Black leader, we're picking up an unusual signal. Are you spotting anything? Yeah, I see it. We'll check it out. BB-8, what do you got? There appear to be a number of small craft heading our way. Raise the shield. We're being kidnapped. Folks, that is going to be it for today's video. Thank you so much for coming to Hollywood Studios with me and for watching my very first YouTube video on this channel. If you liked it, make sure to hit that thumbs up button. It really does help out brand new channels like mine. Hit the follow button if you haven't already because we are going to Epcot in the next video. It's going to be a great time. Lots of other trips planned for the future. Thank you so much and have a great day.